Um, well, it's always a question how you look at things. Um, I'm not surprised that growth is coming down because in 2017, the growth rate in the euro area was um, almost twice the potential growth rate. That could not continue for very long, particularly because the output gap is now closed. The output gap that was quite big um, from the crisis. So we, we, in a way, should have expected that there was a normalization coming, um, at least down to the potential growth rate, which for the euro area is around 1.5%. Now the IMF has revised down the growth figure for the euro area this year to 1.3. That's slightly below the potential growth. But I think there were some temporary factors, particularly in Germany, the second half of last year, which um, then have a negative overhang into 2019. So my baseline scenario is the same as the IMF and CCB, that in the second half of 2019, um, things will improve a bit um, back to normal. Um, but in the sense that we will not see um, the next two, three years, the growth rates of 2017, it's quite okay to say that the best is over, yes, but it doesn't mean that there's a crisis. Hi, I'm Giovanna Bersecci and thank you for watching. You can check out more of our videos by clicking on the boxes on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more from CNBC International. Thank you for watching.